Lindsay. It's hard to believe your graduation day is finally here. It seems like just yesterday I was running out to you on bid day, uh, eating lunch together for the first time, watching Dirty Dancing, painting canvases, and falling head over heels in love with the girl that would soon become my big. I can't hardly put into words what you've meant to me over the last three and a half years. The growth that I've seen as an individual because of your influence on my life is just tremendous. And to say that I'm going to miss you this next semester and um, as your time in the Navy takes you away to different parts of the country and maybe even different parts of the world is an understatement, but I am fully confident that the bond that we have created here at UE um, and the love that we've shared with one another is something that will last forever. And I'm so thankful to have you in my life. I'm so proud of all that you've accomplished and all the while staying true to yourself and influencing others to do the same. You are amazing. I'm so proud of you. I love you so much. And I know that wherever life takes you, you will just be awesome. I love you, Lindsay. Happy graduation. Hey, Lindsay. I just wanted to tell you congratulations on completing your college career. I am so proud of you. But I also wanted to tell you how proud I am to be your sister and that you've made this choice and commitment to protect our freedom. It's really a huge thing for you to do, and I am so incredibly proud to call you my sister and a friend. And I just look up to you so much. You're such a light in all of our lives. And I cannot wait to watch this next chapter of your life play out. Good luck in boot camp. I know you're going to kill it. Love you. Lindsay, I love you for the selfless and admirable person that you are. You're going to do great things in your lifetime. Best of luck to you. I love Lindsay Maper because she has helped me find my forever home at UE and she has always been a true and honest friend that I could always go to if I needed some honest words of advice. And some honest words of advice that I could give Lindsay is to just be yourself. Um, you are one of the most like self-driven, determined, and hardworking people I've ever met in my life. And um, whether you're gonna be like a teacher later on in life, I think you're gonna be a phenomenal educator and our future generations will be so blessed to have you as their teacher. Just as truly as I've been blessed to have you and call you as a friend. You're gonna do so great. Um, thank you for choosing to serve our country and I think you're going to do amazing and I will always be here for you if you ever need anybody, anybody at any point in time. I love you, Lindsay. I truly do. Hi, Lindsay. Congrats on graduation. I've always looked up to you, but now I look up to you even more because you're doing something so selfless like going into the Navy. I know you're going to do great and you're going to kick boot camps, but see ya. Hi, Lindsay. I just want to wish you good luck um, as you go off to the Navy. Um, so proud of you, and you really put your heart and soul in everything you do. We'll be rooting for so, you. So, I've been thinking about this for a while. Like, why do I love Lindsay? Because I do love her, but I've never stopped to think what makes me love her. I think that her kind-heartedness is always admirable. Um, she always gives people second chances even if she shouldn't, which I mean that's her and that, that just shows how kind-hearted she is. She is always willing to step in and help you no matter what. She will drop everything on her plate to help someone else out when they're in need. And I, I think that those qualities are part of the reason I love her and I know there are many more reasons that I love her but to keep it short and sweet I'll leave it with that. Good luck Lindsay. Why do I love Lindsay? Because she's my G big and she is like such an inspiration. You have taught me so much um, in these couple of years that we've gotten to know each other um, here in college. I think you're incredible. I'm so proud of you for, you know, finding something you're passionate about and going for it. I um, I congratulate you on your graduation, and I wish you nothing but the best um, in the armed forces, Lindsay. I'll be praying for you, and um, you know I've got a love in my heart for you, Greek fam. All right, love you, G little, aka Glittle. <laughs> Hi, Lindsay. I just want to congratulate you on graduation and wish you luck on this next chapter of your life. 
uh, after watching and being a part of military life firsthand for the last three years. I know that you have such an exciting and crazy adventure ahead of you, but I'm so confident that you are going to inspire and impact so many people. You are truly going to change lives and I'm so excited for you and so proud to know you. Um, I just want to thank you for your service and congratulate you and wish you luck. Hi Lindsay, I just want to say good luck whenever you go to basic and I'm going to miss you tons and I can't wait for you to get back and however long that is. Um, I love you so much and I'm going to miss you. Hey Lindsay, I just wanted to let you know that you are definitely one of my favorite sisters ever since I joined Chi Omega. Ever since like I became a new member and went through initiation, you are always so welcoming and so supportive and it's really meant a lot to me. One of my favorite Chi Omega memories is after we went to lunch with the national consultant and we sat in my car for like three hours just talking about random stuff. And it was definitely one of the like my favorite times in college. You've always been so sweet and so welcoming and everything. And you're definitely like one of my favorite people that I've met in college. And I can't wait to see everything you do in the armed forces. Good luck. Hi, Lindsay. I just wanted to wish you the best of luck in all your future endeavors. I only knew you for four years, but those four years, you taught me a lot about how to remain positive in uh, difficult situations. You always had a smile on your face, and I really admire that about you. Um, I hope everything in your future goes well, and just know that if you ever needed anything at all, I'm just a phone call away. Good luck, Lindsay. Be safe. Hey, Lindsay. I wanted to say good luck in the Navy, and we know you're going to be awesome there, and maybe you can teach them a few things. Good luck. Hey Lindsay, I just wanted to tell you that I'm so incredibly proud of this, the decision that you've made and just let you know that I love you so much and these last couple years of college would not have been the same without you. You are one of the truest friends that I've ever had and I wish everybody had a heart as big as yours. And I know that whatever you do in the future, you're gonna do it above and beyond and succeed and just be an awesome person. and. People are so lucky to have you in their lives and I don't ever want you to forget that. Bye. I just to say that I am so proud of you and I'm so excited to see where this path takes you and I'm so, so grateful and blessed that Kayo brought me you. I wouldn't want to share my birthday with anyone else and I think the fact that you share a birthday of March 19th with me just shows how truly special you are because I think that's a pretty special day. But anyways, um, I just can't wait to see what you do, and I think this path that you've chosen is such a selfless path, and I just think that's that just speaks to who you are as a person. You've always put forth other people's feelings before your own, and I think that you're a very caring and compassionate and selfless person, and I think this speaks to that so much. And as someone who's had multiple family members in the military, I just like the sacrifice that you sacrifice is huge and I just am so grateful for that as well. I respect you so much. I always have and it's just, just like you're amazing. And when I look back on my college days, my five whole years of college and my four years of Kyo, you know, I don't think about like, you know, oh I was so stressed out about this class. Like, oh I like wish I would have gone to the gym more. I wish I would have like partied more. I think about the people in my life and the people who have always who have stayed and been consistent in my in my years in college and you are 110 percent one of those people you've always been there for me you know you didn't know me that well and i just appreciate that so much and i appreciate you so much and i just i can't wait to see what you do with this and i can't wait to see where your life takes you and where this path takes you and i'm one of the little things I'm supposed to give words of encouragement, and I don't think I should be giving advice, <laughs> but I guess I will give you a piece of advice that I myself am trying to do, and that's to take life by the horns and just like go with it. Like I'm, I'm very much someone that I stay in my comfort zone, you know. I try to like not venture out too far because I'm nervous and. I think the fact that you've, you've chosen this path just shows that you do take life by the horns and I just think you continue to do that. Like I feel like you have such a free spirit and you just, you're driven by doing what's best for you and I think that's amazing and I just, 
I'm gonna miss you a lot and I love you a lot and I hope that this is everything you want it to be so that's all I have to say after my third take because I cannot stare at my face in this camera anymore but I love you hi Lindsay Greetings from an old lady. I know it's been a long time since we've talked, but I wanted to say congratulations on your graduation. I am so excited for you. I have been creeping on your Facebook and your Instagram, and I just wanted to let you know that I know everyone is so proud of the woman that you've grown into the last four years. And we're so excited and so proud of you for the next step that you're about to take on your big adventure. Congratulations on everything, and love you, sister. Bye. Hey, little one. Congratulations on your graduation. I just wanted to let you know I'm so proud of you for everything that you've done. You're such a strong person, and you're going to do so many great things in life. I wish you the best, and I love you. Bye. Hey, Lindsay. Congratulations on your graduation. I am so proud to be your Kyo granny. And I can't believe that it's finally time for you to graduate. It just makes me feel super old. But you are a wonderful, loving, caring, fabulous person. And I am so excited to get you to be able to watch you grow into a even more fabulous woman as you continue on. Good luck in all your endeavors and know that I'm always here for you no matter what. Love you. Um, when this project was gathered, I was really excited just to share a little bit about just answering simple questions of why I love you. And any words or advice I have, Lindsay, you are always so, like, you're so important to me. You have so much, like, valiant effort to give to the world. You're so brave and bold and spunky and spontaneous. And I just always love your personality and how you've always had a go-get attitude. You never stop. And you always, always, always try your best. And you encourage others to do the same. Like, that is incredible. So... You're just a really cool person. I appreciate that about you. And some words or advice, like, I'm proud of you. I'm so proud of you for going into the Navy. Having breakfast with you, like, that was a great just snapshot into what you want to do. And girl, go for it. You've got a great head on your shoulders, and I can't wait to see what happens. Yeah, Lindsay, you're going to you're gonna do awesome in this world. So, all right, I love you. I'm going to see you a lot. But, bye. So when I think about why I love Lindsay Maper, um, there's a lot of different things that come to my mind. Um, I've known Lindsay for four years, but it seems like much longer than that just because she's such a warm and loving person. Um, why I love you, Lindsay? Because you're genuine, you're smart, you are funny, um, you always care about others, and you always ask how I'm doing um, because you're super loud and I can recognize your laugh from anywhere, uh, because you love friends and Harry Potter and everything that you love makes you you. So, why I love Lindsay? Because you're Lindsay. Um, <laughs> and then as far as uh, giving a piece of advice for you, Linz, um, I'm not sure that I can give you any advice that you don't already know yourself, you know? So, most of our friendship is just talking through what's going on, and I think that you have a great set of morals, and you just gotta keep on doing your thing. Um, things might be stressful, and you might not know what's exactly gonna happen or the life plan is, but it's gonna work itself out because you're you. Um, and you know I'm always a phone call away, and I love you a lot. Hi, Lindsay! Hi, Lindsay! Hi. Happy graduation! Happy graduation! We are so proud Hi. of you. We're so proud of you. We love you, we miss you. We love you, we miss you. I, we know you're going into basic training. And we are so proud of you. We're we, so proud of you. We hope we get to see you before then. We hope, you get, we hope we get to see you tomorrow. But, Mike, you wanted to say something? Yeah, it's, we're very, very proud of you. There's no greater honor than serving your country. So we're very proud. We hope we get to see you soon. We cannot believe how grown up you are and what an amazing woman you have become. We love you. Can you say bye-bye? Bye-bye. Hi, my beautiful sister. Hi. We just wanted to say good luck at boot camp, and we love you, and we can't wait to see you. 
and welcome to the Navy family. Yeah. Love you. Bye. Bye. Hi, Lindsay. Max here. I just wanted to say that I love you um, because you always took really good care of me and you spoiled me when my mommy was gone. And um, uh, I don't know what else to say, but I love you. And one word of advice for you is always be happy to see people. Um, I don't know, go into the bathroom a lot. Going in the bathroom is always good because you can relax in there and you can be left alone. And being left alone and taking naps is important. Give people kisses when you see them. And um, I think that's about it. But I'm gonna miss you. And um, thanks for taking care of me. Love you, Lindsay. Bye. I'm gonna be sad. I love Lindsay because she is the most genuine person I know. I have never and will never meet somebody as nice, considerate, or unabashedly into the things she's into than Lindsay. Why do I love Lindsay? Well, ever since we were kids, people have been saying that we are pretty much twins, and as we've grown up, that stigma has still stuck. So it's safe to say that at least part of it is because I love myself and you're basically me. So there's that going for us. But in all seriousness, you are just one of the most incredible people that I know. No matter what happens to you, you always get back up and you always try and make everybody happy, even at the expense for your own self. You are one of the most genuine people I know and I couldn't love you more for those reasons alone. I just want you to remember that while you're going through basic, boot camp, whatever it's called in the Navy, keep your head up. It's all a mind game. You just gotta be mentally tough. They're gonna break you down, but they're gonna build you back up and you're gonna come out better on the other side. Good luck.